All right, what's up, guys? This is a test video just to show out some of the apps I've ported from Android over to Windows Phone. Running Windows 10 Mobile. So these are some of the apps I've got installed already. And I actually haven't looked at them yet, so I'm going to check them out and see how they run now. And this is on build 10 166. Right. So the first one we're going to try is Popcorn Time. Alright, so we're going to have to return on the developer option in the settings real quick. Alright, and we're going to try it again. Sweet. Let's see if we can actually watch some movies or videos. Uh, it's transurgent. All right, we're going. Let's try watch it now. See what happens. Okay, so nothing happening yet. I'm wait, give it a few more seconds. Alright, let's see if we can hit this X. Try one once more. Okay, so let's try and download it. Alright, let's see if we can find the downloads. says checking data so it'd be pretty cool if we'd be able to download even though it doesn't seem like the stream is working but we're gonna try another movie just in case so let's try Kingsman and watch it now fingers crossed Still doesn't seem to be working. I think I'll leave it on that screen later on, see if anything ever comes up. Okay. And checking data hasn't moved yet, so let's just try another app and we'll come back to that later. Okay, next on the list we've got Steam. See if Steam works. 
And yes, it does. So let's try and log in here real quick. Okay, log in. And it has sent me a verification email, so I'm going to check that real quick. But it's looking promising, so let's see if this works for us. Hopefully you'll be able to do some chatting, maybe search the store. Let's see what this holds. Okay, so I'm going to key this in real quick. Okay, so get this to focus. All right, so let's see if we can do some chatting. Oh, okay, it's pretty cool. Let's see if I can send them a message. Seems like it works. See if I can check my library. <laughs> oh man, that's pretty awesome. It actually shows a notification, which is pretty cool. Let's see, because we don't even have a Steam app for Windows Phone they actually haven't made an app for us so this is pretty interesting okay uh, looks like he replied so pretty cool So you know the chat works. Let's see if the store pulls up. Let's see catalog. Oh man, that's awesome. That is awesome. And it actually gives me notifications too. So it's just like a it's just like a regular Steam app for Windows Phone. It's pretty impressive. This is through the Project Astoria leak, which I happen to acquire now.
Hmm. And it's pretty awesome though. See how the store looks on Windows Phone. It's a little laggy, but it's to be expected. But there's definitely no excuse for Steam not to make a or make an official Steam app for Windows Phone. Let's see if I can get the other tabs to pop up here. New. Yep. Works perfectly. It's pretty nice. Very, very impressive. All right, let's try another app. Okay, so let's try PlayStation app, see if I can log into my PlayStation. <laughs> That'd be pretty awesome. Oh. Oh well. So it looks like I can't use that without Google Play services, so I'm gonna have to wait for a, a workaround. But it looks like the actual app is displaying, just can't load any information. Oh, let's try and log in anyway. <laughs> this would be pretty impressive if it works. Hmm. Doesn't look like it's gonna work. So, try another app. Let's see here. And here we got Animania, which I downloaded. Let's see if that works on here, which would be great. Okay, accept. Awesome. And let's see if we can load some anime. It's very impressive. And it's buttery smooth too. Alright, let's try and browse. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Uh oh. Let's try and try and see if we can run an episode. Uh, here we go. Can't play this video. Oh boy. Let's try another link. Same error. Okay, let's see if we can download it. Since it doesn't seem to be able to play it, doesn't look like that's working. Oh, there we go. Just try and download it first. Okay, so we're gonna just do a direct download, see if it downloads. Download in progress. Let's see how that's going. My downloads. Mm. 
no application compatible to play file. Wow. Very, very interesting. Let's try another another show. Try this one. Excel World Episode One. Let's try and do external video player, see what happens. Okay, it's playing through the browser for some reason. Oh, I see. <laughs> Downloaded an FLV video. I don't know if Windows Phone can play FLV, but I guess we're going to find out. Okay, downloads. Let's see, it may have actually downloaded. Yeah. Oh, it was downloading. Well, I guess we're going to find out if we can play it. Shouldn't be much longer. It'd be pretty impressive if it does. But it doesn't look like you're going to be able to watch videos directly on the app, which might have something to do with the file format. So let's see if we can play it. Search for app in the store. I don't know of any, uh, hmm. I might have to download VLC player and check on that later. But let's try and see if we can watch that stream. See if we can get back to it. It does load relatively quickly though. For a direct port with with no no editing. Let's try air gear, see if air gear works. Okay. So we're gonna do play. Let's see if it comes in. Nope, doesn't want to come. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to come back and see if I can play that video I downloaded. But, it looks like that's all. I just downloaded Casper. I haven't, haven't really figured out how to get my Snapchat information on here which is this is probably the only snapchat application that windows phone would be able to use so i'll probably make another video on that but it's pretty cool catch you guys later on the next one